Hey there, my name is Nick Klein. And I'm Melissa Haley. And now it's time for... Another Update! And actually, Melissa, we have a huge update for CCAR. February 26th, we launched a brand new website, and it is awesome. So on the Collin County Association of Realtors website, CCAR.net, you now have the opportunity to fill out your forms online. You no longer have to print them, fill them out, and scan them back in. How amazing is that? You know what I hate when you sign up for an event or, or a class and you totally forget what day it is or you don't know the address? Well, on the new website, it'll sync the address to your GPS and it automatically syncs to your calendar on your Apple or your Outlook, so any of your mobile devices, and you are set to go. A lot of people don't know, we have LoneStarHomes.com as well. LoneStarHomes.com is a website that the CCAR staff has gone out to interview community leaders and ask them questions about what's happening in their community. They've included that information, so this would be a great tool for you to share with any relocation clients that you might have. And another great feature on LoneStarHomes.com and CCAR.net is that monthly blogs will now start appearing, talking about local events, news, political awareness type activities. It's something you definitely want to educate yourself on. And on LoneStarHomes.com, since you are a CCAR member, your listings will now be featured ahead of other listings. This is a great member benefit for you. As you know, our websites have all the information, anything you would want to know about CCAR, what's going on with the economy, with our pulse reports, and so much more. So please log on and check those out. The website will be updated on a regular basis, so let us know if you have any feedback. So another great member benefit that you have as a member of CCAR is that we have this poll statistics available at CCAR.net. You can find great information about what's happening in our local area with regards to home prices, days on market, and so forth. I actually use it a lot. I use it for listing presentations, buyer presentations. This is some good information. In fact, this month, one of the most interesting statistics I have seen is that new listings are up. 14% compared to last year. I know in my personal business right now, I've got about eight or nine listings coming to the market. So I think there's a lot of truth to that. Do you, do you have some kind of I hip agree. pockets? Yeah. yeah. No, I totally see the same thing. We see new listings hitting the market. We see buyers still jumping in. As a matter of fact, closed sales are even up 7%, which is awesome because yeah. like we talked about previously, Gosh, the, the new listings are coming, but there's still demand. That pent-up demand is still there for buyers to actually want to come in and, yeah. and purchase homes and at a premium price. That's right, right. The price right now is up nearly 9.5% compared That's to huge. last year. Yeah. So new <coughs> listings are coming to the market, mm -hmm. but they're selling in a matter of days, mm -hmm. and the price is up almost 10% compared to last year. Exactly. Yeah. The, the economy estate, is booming around here. Real estate market is doing awesome. It is amazing right now. And you can get all this information at the CCAR website, which is CCAR.net. Well, enough about that. Nick, what have you been up to these days? Well, actually helped set a world record. I planned it all. I invited everybody. I'm it sorry, was, you helped set a world record? I, I did. Did you plan the entire the event whole yourself? Thing. Oh my gosh, that is insane. I think we may have planned the same event. Oh yeah? Yeah. With Were North you, Texas YPN? Yes. Oh. It was fantastic. We partnered with the Tango Tab and threw a huge that event. event. Yeah. yeah. That was awesome. The one that you were at. Mm -hmm. The one that you planned. At 9 a.m. Oh my gosh. On a Saturday. On a Saturday. Over 3,000 people came. Kids, people of all ages to make sandwiches for the homeless. It was incredible. So did you expect that many people to be there? I don't think we expected that many people to be there, but we made over 32,000 sandwiches and wow. enough food was donated for 210,000 people. And of course we set the Guinness Book of World Records for most people simultaneously making a sandwich. That's incredible. Who got the sandwiches? That's a lot of food. That is a lot of food. Um, we actually didn't eat any of it. We gave it all to charities and food banks around the North Texas area. Um, the Bridge, the Soup Mobile, and the North Texas Food Bank are just some, just to name a few. What an awesome thing to do. Really. It was amazing. It really was. Good job. Is there anything else YPN's going to be doing in the near future? Yes, we actually have an incredible event coming up. It's called Swirls and Whirls. It will be at Whirly Ball in Plano on March 30th from 12 to 3. And we will be playing arcade games, Whirly Ball. We'll have margarita machines, and there will be some awesome networking. Nice. Awesome. And Melissa and I will be there. We're going to yeah. twirl at Swirl and Whirls. Awesome. awesome. We're looking forward to seeing you until the next world record needs to be broken. There All you right. go. Bye-bye. <laughs> well, thanks this month for joining us. My name is Nick Klein. 
And I'm Melissa Haley. And we'll see you next month for another, another update. update.